Afternoon guys, it's me again, Jenny here from Just Jenny Journaling. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is going to be a quick um, flip through. Um, I'm working on, I have been asked to work on some um, traveller's notebooks for um, with a theme, Be Bold and be strong they're notebooks for a particular um sort of assembly day and um this is the first order that's going out so um i wanted to just go, go through it with you i'm doing um, a selection actually um but this one needed to be out for this weekend and as it's wednesday i need to get it posted so this one's going off to devon and it's going to be for the be bold um uh, assembly this weekend so I just thought I'd show you very quickly I've done a, 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 quite a few with the printable on the front and this from Mrs Cogs the Gibson girls collection and they're absolutely beautiful images Mrs Cogs crafts I will actually link the her shop below for her lovely printables so I've got quite a few of these I'm doing the be strong the be bold because there's two different um, um, programs and I'm also doing a set of um, three or four uh, journals uh, travelers notebooks just to journal in so um, they'll be available on my Etsy as well so as I said um, to this one here I basically just covered in um, this beautiful hound's tooth fabric I don't know if it's vintage but I found a huge um, stack of it uh, or roll is it in a child's shop so um, I used it on quite a few I, I really liked the black white and red thing going on hold on let me just move that like so I love that black white and red and so what I've done here I've done um the image and I've, I've done it into a pocket so the lace on the front it's beautiful I love it and there's uh, it's actually a pocket so you can pop things in should you wish so those can come out and it can just be plain so I quite like it plain to be fair or you can pop bits in if you like. Um, so as you go in, oh, I've used as well, I'll just show you what I've used. Um, the paper pack that I used was this one here, the um, English Moments. Let me just move my bits and pieces there. English Moments, this is from the haul I got from the, um, the works a few weeks ago. So that's the English Moments I've used and um, for the little note let's and the um for decoup not uh yeah the collage for the flashcards i've used um again these were from the works as well these little notelets here i've also i found i've used um and i will be using quite a few pages from these books um it's a, a charity shop find and they are basically for stamp collecting and they basically have i don't know if you can see difficult way you can see there all sorts of themes i think it's going back to about 1966 um but for, for actually collecting your stamps and popping them in but um, i just love the papers it's blank so there's railways there's all sorts of flowers birds and so you will see them in in this set of um in this set of uh, this project i'm working on and this one here this is another stamp book, but uh, I just love the pages. And I think if you can see, it's got these beautiful images on across the top, these little banners with the stamps. This is copyright 1950, so it's quite an old book, but the paper is beautiful. The paper is beautiful. So you will see these um, pages interspersed in these books, okay? So you open it up and I've used some colouring pages as well. I thought it looked really nice with the black and white and they, they are feature in each book. Um, so I've done a little, um, what's the word? Oh, definition of the word bold here. I made it into a little collage on the pocket with a, a postage stamp. That's got the assembly programme um, in the front. That's for the morning. The afternoon assembly programme is in the back. And as I did with the Be Courageous uh, programs, you take them out and wherever you're writing um, or wherever you stop for lunch, you can pop them in wherever you stop for lunch. And um, I thought that's useful because we all make notes differently. I use lots and lots of space, um, to be honest, doing mine, but you know, we're all different, so that's how they're movable. Um, there's three little um, oh, tabs. This has got a little lace tab on the... I think I love that little daisy 
and then it's got a little ribbon tab and a little bit of fabric on the third one so let's just go in let's go in okay so all the way through i've just done little collages um and it would be like mrs cole does her flashcards. Uh, the Psalm the Psalm uh, 138 was the, the theme scripture, and I basically printed it onto tracing paper and popped it in. They are, the theme scripture is in every um, book, each one. Okay, so um, lined paper. There's um, check. I've done a little bit of stamping. I've used the um, little chalk, the little pad, uh, all the way through to create interest. I think that's lovely really nicely. I've uh, done a little bit of stamping, a bit of stamping through. That's the first of those stamp, that stamp paper. It's beautiful. From that, I don't know if you can see the, if you can see it on the top there, just how lovely it is. They'll be all the way through. And again, this is just sort of um, from the program, just the little um, prompts because it's uh, will cover that bit of stamping. That's from the, the theme of the um uh the stamp paper the stamp book so you'd have little sections and that's got birds i just love it i think it's and the paper feels lovely it's a really nice weight so it's one of my stamps um, it looks very gibson girls i thought so i pop that in um again a little journal prompt from the program and if you can see beautiful images of the stamps on there um, just examples of what they can collect. Butterfly, I love butterflies. Did a bit of edge punching here, and uh, I thought it looked nice just peeping through on the poppies. And that little bit of paper. This is from a book, uh, Lark Wife the Candlefoot, I think it uh, the book is. And um, I think it's a, a company, a TV series, I'm not sure. But I just love the little images through, uh, through so I'll pop that in. Uh, this is a botanical little book page, and I'll pop that in because I like it. Again, you've got your collage there. These are popped in, uh, clipped in all the way through with these little teardrop um, paper clips. I've, gone, I've got a botanical um, in the middle of each of these, and on this one I've just popped bold. Um, on the end of the, the um, stringy bits. Okay. So lots and lots of room for note taking in these ones. Um, and I tried, as I said, to give a little selection of different papers and things. Um, it's got a little butterfly on it, that tab there. See, a little bit of edge punching. Butterflies and insects, and um, that's from that this stamp book, uh, stamp collecting book. A bit of stamping again. Just so if you can see how lovely that is. I haven't counted the pages actually. I think I've gone for about forty pages. I will pop it in the description though once I get round to it. And I said this one's actually spoken for and is going to be posted out today, but it just gives you an idea of um, what the format, the layout's going to be for the rest of them. So that's the basically little bulb pin with a little um, uh, silver bead on it. So I've done a little flip pocket on the back, and it has uh, the afternoon's uh, program. And I've just got a little sort of big, a big journal card there, really to be fair, touch in the back. But I just like the way it looks. So that's it. That's the first of the um, the Be Bold um, uh, Traveller's Notebook insert for the convention, the circuit assembly. That's going out today, and there will be more. And I'm um, working to make some little interesting, as I say, traveller's notebooks that are just not themed. So for just for general journaling. And they will be available quite soon. So I hope you enjoy this, guys. Um, if you haven't, um, haven't um, this is the first time you've seen one of my videos and you like it, please like and subscribe. If, yes, obviously, if you do. And don't if you don't. And uh, look forward to seeing you again.
if you join me on my junk journaling journey. Take care, guys. Bye. Bye.